Welcome back. Semi-state Saturday in the Wabash Valley. Two local teams look for two wins to advance to the state finals. Starting in 1A, number one, Bar Reeve, who faced off with number two, Evansville Christian at the Hatchet House in the semi-state semifinals. Coach Josh Thompson and the Vikings looking for their fourth win against the 1A top 10 team in the state tourney. Vikings down eight out of the gate, but they work it inside to Evan Waymeyer, who finishes plus the foul to get Bar Reeve on the board. Bar Reeve grabs their first lead in the second quarter. Braden Neff drills the top of the key three to make it 12-11. Next time down the floor, another big three for the Vikings. This time, Kendall Graber knocks down the trifecta. He had 10 in the game. Vikings led by four, kept it rolling in the second half. Donnie Miller gets a three. That gives the Vikings a six-point lead. The Eagles wouldn't go away. Josiah Dunham drives inside for the hoop and harm. He had 33 points. We are tied at 30. Final seconds of the third, Donnie Miller going baseline. Fadeaway jumper just before the buzzer. Vikings led 32-30 at the end of three. It was all Bar Reeve in the fourth. Braden Nepp driving and finishing off the glass. He led Bar Reeve with 15. Then Seth Wagner nice inside for the scoop layup to put the Vikings up by four. And finally, how about Donnie Miller with the bank shot three as the dagger. He had 13. Number one, Bar Reeve knocks off number two, Evansville Christian, 54-44 in the sectional semis. That would set up the semi-state title game between number one, Bar Reeve, and number eight, Bethesda Christian. Vikings looking to punch their ticket to states. It was the Patriots, though, coming out strong out of the gates. Stephen Tierney knocks down the corner three for the game's first points. Then Sam Milligan knocks down the free throw line jumper. He had 17. Bethesda went on a 14-0 run to take a 16-2 lead. Bar Reeve trying to get back in it. Donnie Miller with a nice bounce pass to Wagler for the bucket. Then it's Miller knocking down the three on the wing to get the Vikings a little bit closer. Second quarter, Wagler gets the triple to get Bar Reeve within a dozen at 24-12. Wagler doing his best all night long to keep the Vikings comeback hopes alive as he gets another three to go. He led Bar Reeve with 17 points, but Bethesda Christian had too much firepower. They beat Bar Reeve 63-38 to advance to the state finals for the first time in program history. Vikings finish the season at 25-3. and three.